Good morning, people of the world. Here, today, we have an unboxing of the Assassin's Creed Brotherhood Van Brace Gauntlet, whatever you want to call it, but I can barely fit it in the frame. This box is huge. This is compared to my forearm. Oh wow, it's actually like the same length. Alright, so let's uh, see the sides. Here we have Etsy Auditory Roleplay Gauntlet, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, features spring loaded action. That is on like every single side on this one, this one, and oh, uh, it says. Alright, so let's take a look at the first side. As you can see, it says it's the auditory roleplay gauntlet. And then the gauntlet. As you can see on the front side, it says Etsy Auditory Roleplay Gauntlet. And then here is the gauntlet up close. And as you can see, it's Assassin's Creed Brotherhood for ages 17 and up, which basically rules me out. Here is the next side. As you can see, Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. And then that side and once again features spring-loaded action. And the opposite side of that um, just features the other view of it, so Assassin's Creed Brotherhood, and then that other view, and then features spring-loaded action, and it says Etsy Auditory Role-Playing Gauntlet once again. On the back side here we have some more toys. Here we have some features, just pause it if you want to read it. Here we have some pictures of the gauntlet, and once more, it's the auditory roleplay gauntlet and Assassin's Creed Brotherhood. Alright, now let's open this thing. And here we have a gauntlet. I barely needed a knife, and this thing wasn't heavily packaged. Uh, twisty, twisty. Now this thing, it wasn't a pre-order type of thing. Instead, it was an order-only type of thing. I'm not sure if you can still get it, but... Um, I got mine from GameStop, and I was mentioned of it, and this thing just slides out. Um, I hope it's, like, functional. I'm having a tough time. The reason that they did Brotherhood instead of Revelations, I have no idea, but that's just the way it is. As you can see, there are three straps to fit around your arm. Alright, so now I'm just going to put it on if I can. As you can see it is spring loaded but this piece wants to wiggle back and forth like this and it just goes in like so maybe. As you can see this piece moves a bit back and forth but I guess that's what you gotta do. Anyway so all that you do is just put it in real nice and just wait for that click and then you're pretty much all set. Now I'm going to put this on, and then I'm going to show you this button right here. You push that, and the blade comes out. Well, here I have it, and this is the other side. Feels like it needs a bit of adjusting, but this thing, it probably needs one more strap because it still moves around, and this is about as tight as I can get it. All right, so here we go for the button, and that was out of frame, so let me do it once more. And here we go again with the button, and here we have and Assassin's Creed Brotherhood Hidden Blade. So, as you can see, it's plastic and it's not metal, and this assassin symbol doesn't exactly look like it, but it's a pretty, pretty good replica of Ezio's Hidden Blade. Alright, so I hope you enjoyed. Please subscribe above if you would like to, or you can just do whatever the flip you want to. I don't really care. I just kind of am happy that I have a hidden blade. Watch out. Goodbye. All right, one more thing. I have forgotten something very important. Okay, so say you're at school and you have this, and you're probably going to be threatened of a knife or something, but just in case, there is a lock on it, and it's right here. I guess I'll have to take it off to show you. Alright, so here we have it, and here is the lock. As you can see, it's unlocked right now, and if I just turn it that way, then I'm guessing it won't work. Yeah, it's not working now. Of course, if we turn it back, 
I guess it automatically does it. So yeah, again, this is my Hidden Blade unboxing, and I like it pretty much. It's spring loaded.